Hello and welcome. Training the right way here. Sorry for the delay in uh, videos, but we are here. And um, we're talking about Jitsi Meat. This is Jitsi Meat and it's free of charge. It is open source and basically the reason why I am discussing this is because I'm using Zoom at the moment and I'm sure a lot of people are using Zoom but you're paying £17 a month and uh, if you don't uh, use it regularly it's obviously you have to weigh up the cost effectiveness of paying out £17 a month whereas um, Jitsi Meat does exactly the same thing but it's free of charge so yeah which one would you use now obviously this was recommended by a guy on YouTube and up until that point I had no idea about it and uh, I did look around before I chose uh, Zoom that was over two years ago I think so I've been using it for quite a long time um, it obviously is something that I'm going to be using regularly now because of the cost of Zoom, trying to save some money. And to be fair, I only really use it for two sessions a week, plus any uh, sort of one-to-ones I do. And um, at the moment, they are quite rare. So two times a week is, is what I'm talking about, eight times a month. If to weigh up is it cost effective and to be honest with you it's not not at the moment so I'm going to be transferring over to Jitsi let's have a look at the uh, application which runs entirely in a web browser so here we are this is uh, Jitsi um, and it is as I say it's free of charge um, you don't even have to run, have an account. You don't have to make one. It does allow you to link in to your Google um, Calendar if you have one. Uh, you can, of course, link it. It will give you your um, meetings that you've got set up in your um, in your calendar, and of course, you can then add on a Jitsi link for that particular meeting um, what I'll do I'll show you ones that I've already done so these two are set up um, you can of course just start a meeting just by clicking the button and it will give you a random link you can make up your own you can make your own which is quite handy and then start the meeting now let's go into a recent meeting that I've set up and we can show you the application for this because it's uh you do need to en enable your hardware um, currently my microphone and my camera are being used by OBS but you do have other choices with video so we can select the other camera hello you can see my my bathroom there so not very not very good um, and the audio settings there it obviously will not let you, let you do anything um, until you do that the actions there we're going to have a look at the settings you can change all of these settings so the audio, you can uh, do your audio and uh, output so it works video selection selecting your cameras um, which one's the ca that one there camera so that's the other camera in my office that's behind me so there are virtual backgrounds so it's all very um, you know 
all very good. It's very much like a uh, Zoom or an OBS. Put a background on there. Notifications, so the all these things that you can set. Um, the profile, your profile name, and the Gravitar email. I don't know what Gravitar is, but whatever. The calendar, you can select your calendar. I currently have my calendar connected, so it will automatically go into that. Um, shortcuts, keyboard shortcuts, and more. So it's all very much pre-meeting, um, blah, 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 audio, video, yeah, there we go. And um, essentially all you do is uh, join, join the meeting, and we're in the meeting. So this is the same as the, um, the uh, Zoom. You have your little thing down the bottom here. Uh, screen sharing. Open the chat window. Uh, raise your hand so that you know that you want to ask a question. This is the participants that we have in the in the meeting. And tile view and. Uh, there are lots of other actions that you can do. There's a whiteboard. Settings, there's all sorts of various things there. And if you're really, really not sure, you can ask for help. There is a start a live stream, which I haven't done yet, but I might, might investigate that. But for the time being, we're just gonna have a look at this in a basic way and then obviously when you've finished we come out of that right uh, so as you've seen it's all very simple and it does work in a browser a browser window however you can if you wish to you can download an app for your phone and your tablet so you'll find this down here by the app store google play uh, and of course that will give it you on your phone is it any good i think it is i think it's quite good it's really very efficient it's obviously the main reason is it's free that's the um main incentive for me to use jitsi uh, over zoom and of course Zoom doesn't give you anything more, I don't think, than you can get on um, Gypsy. So it's all very good. I will do a, uh, I'll do another review of this um, at some point in the future, and also go more in depth about things like the um, live streaming thing that I showed you earlier. So we, we'll do a video about that just to show you uh, how that works. But in the meantime. That is it for me. Have a very good day. Don't forget to share, like, thumbs up, whatever. And uh, come back again very soon for another video. Have a good day.